Javon Howard broke down multiple times today. He said the first time he, had, he thought he could actually become Michigan's head coach was the moment he drove home from his interview with Ward Manuel. I just stopped for a second, you know, shut the key off in the, in the ignition, and I started thinking about, you know, what if Ward just called me back and said, hey, you're the next coach at the University of Michigan. And I just started getting goosebumps, and, <laughs> and all kind of emotions started flowing within my head. And, and I would say that with a day later, you know, Coach Ward called me, and he said, hey, you know, would, I, would I like to be the head coach of the, the University of Michigan basketball team? And I said, yes, <laughs> yes. Quick yes. You said you don't look in the past, you only look forward, and that you're here right now. If things go well, the next five years, is going to the NBA and following in his footsteps and taking a job down the road something you would consider if everything goes as, as planned here in Michigan? Well, if everything goes well in the next five years and my contract expires, hopefully Ward Manuel will extend my deal. <laughs> so you would like to be a Michigan coach for a long time? My plan is to coach Michigan, and I'm looking forward to this. It'd be nice to someday, you know, go up in the Raptors as a, you know, my jersey number 25, and then also uh, some type of way uh, as a coach, twice, <laughs> two times. You said you expected the question uh, about about your your former teams and the banners that, that right. don't hang in this arena. Right. So many people are wondering, you know, if we'll see Chris Webber around this team, if we'll see Jalen Rose back around with the whole crew. How much? Does reuniting the Fab Five and having those banners hang in Chrysler Center, how much do those stand out as, as big deals to, to your tenure here? Well, the banners in 90, 92 and 93, when they first was taken down, you know, it was one of those moments where it was very hurtful and painful. Um, I understand that that's something that has been discussed before I arrive, of maybe putting the banners back up. I, I'm not sure when that day will ever come. Uh, but I look forward to seeing that day happen. Do you want Chris Webber around this team in the Fab Five United? Chris is my brother. Of course I want to see Chris here. Uh, I'm sure it would not be hard getting Chris to come here and watch a game, support one of his brothers. He didn't hesitate at all with all of that. So confident today and obviously so emotional. NBA Finals, we do want to say on Channel 7 right here tonight, DeMarcus Cousin is dressed for the Warriors. Whether or not he okay. plays is still the big question. No Kevin Durant, though. What a moment for Coach Juwan. Yeah. You, you can feel how happy he is to return home. Coach know. Juwan, right? Is that crazy to say? <laughs> yeah, no, it's no, it really is. Yeah. 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 Now he's got to get to work. Mm -hmm. Make some things happen. All right, Brad, thanks.